As time goes by, technology is advancing at faster and faster rates of speed. North Summit High School has done a great job of staying up on the latest technologies. The last two years we have seen the school purchase as many as 45 laptops for students use alone. Kelly Richens, the school's IT director, has been careful to purchase the best equipment possible for the school's use. One of these latest purchases has many questions and rumors flying about the possibilities of what it could be. I asked just a few of these students what they think this newfangled technology is. Um, it's actually a telegraphic transportation device. I stepped in there one time. Yeah, walked out in Beijing. How did that happen? It's not natural. You know, I think it's a Bigfoot tracker. Mrs. Marsh is on a mission to find Bigfoot. I basically think that it is just a mind control device to just keep everyone in the vice principal's grasp. I mean, we got to revolt. Brett Richens is going to control the entire school, and suddenly I just feel like I love Brett Richens. I, I love the Richens family. CTR, CTR. Looks like something with a really big name. It's a bomb. Can't you see the lights blinking? As you can see, the stories have become too outrageous for Channel 38 to stand by and say nothing. I spoke with Kelly and the two men who installed the Wi-Fi connection to see what exactly this new technology is and what it does. This is a high-performance Wi-Fi device that gives you two times range, four times the coverage, and eight times the bandwidth over traditional wireless. Um, North Summit's going to a one-to-one -one initiative with students and laptops, so that creates a density issue in the classrooms. Multiple computers hooking up to a single access point traditionally would actually crash the network. With this device, it actually brings multiple computers on to a single access point with eight antennas in it, and they all run at an appropriate speed. We're upgrading these Wi-Fi to prepare for the possibility of going to one-to-one -to -one computing, where every student will be packing a laptop, and this type of access point will handle the volume of students on laptops. So we're trying to get the infrastructure in place before we have the laptops. 